Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. Today we're gonna take a look at Arcadia. Arcadia is a cool new legend with the spear and the greatsword. We're gonna take a look at combos, a full guide to her attacks and how to play with her. And it's gonna be fun, you're gonna be way better with her after this video. So please leave a like, subscribe because only a very small percentage of you guys watching are actually subscribed. And let's get on with the video. Guys, we're gonna take a look at Arcadia's main attacks. She has three main attacks with each one of her weapons, the side signature, the down signature and the neutral signature. First of the side signature like this. As you see, pretty quick attack. It's a good range and what makes this attack even more interesting is if you hold it down, you can send the attack forwards where you normally would just hit it and miss it. But if you just hold it down, you can send it forward and shoot the projectile at them. It does a little bit less damage, but it's still very interesting that you can use this. Then the down signature like this, as you see, not great damage, but still a pretty nice attack. You can hit it from pretty close by, but not too close and from not too far away. The range isn't too great on this one, but it's useful for edge guarding and for doing some damage on your opponent, maybe for some combos even. Then onto the neutral signature with the great sword, like this. This attack is really interesting. It's always nice to have an attack right above you. So this one is great for defense, but this one's also interesting, the same as with the side signature, where if you hold it down, you do a different attack like this. This attack goes higher up, and the hitbox is a little bit higher. You can't hit this one from the ground up, but it's still a great attack, and still always nice to have some variations. Onto our attacks with the spear. First off, the side signature, like this, you jump on a rhino, hit them far away. The range is good on this attack, the damage is nice on this attack, it's pretty fast as well. I think it's a really great attack. Um, nothing more to say about it, it's just a nice side signature. Always great. Then the down signature like this, you jump up, hit them downwards. The damage is low again, but it's... Then onto our attacks with the spear. First off the side signature like this, you jump on this rhino, hit them far away. The range on this attack is really good, you can hit it from really far away, which is always really nice. The damage is also pretty good and it's also pretty fast, so I really like this as a side signature, I have to say. Then onto the down signature like this, you hit this downwards attack. The damage is not great, it's kind of the same as the down signature with the great sword. Decent for edge guarding, not too big of a hitbox, not too much damage and no knockback, which is always kind of interesting. Then the neutral signature like this. I really like this neutral signature, it has a really interesting hitbox which is always fun to play around with, see how you can use this against your enemies. So this neutral signature, pretty interesting, you can hit it from the ground up, pretty good damage. So overall, some pretty nice moves. First off some spear combos, this first combo is going to be pretty easy, just a basic one but really nice to know nonetheless. It's going to be a side light into a neutral signature and it's going to look something like this. As you see, really easy combo. The dodge winners are a little bit high, they can be around like 5 to 7, but it's still a really nice combo to just hit when they dodged already for some reason, or just to hit it to do some nice damage on some lower tier players. It's always good to know this one, it's just a basic combo for Arcadia that everybody has to use sometimes. Then, this next combo is kind of a longer version of the last one, and it looks really, really cool. So, try to use it sometimes, maybe. It's a side light into a down light into a crafty cancel neutral signature, and it looks something like this. You can get this one with pretty low dodge windows, with like two, maybe one dodge window on the first part, and on the second part, like five to four dodge windows, somewhere around that range. So, that's really nice. It's a really cool combo to show off your skills. You don't need to know how to crafty cancel if you don't know this. Check out the first video link down below in the description. It's a video explaining all the basic things about Brawlhalla. But yeah, it's a really nice combo. Try to use it, see if it works for you. Then this next combo, this is a really amazing one because it's a true combo, which means it's not dodgeable, zero dodge windows. This one's gonna be a down stick into a neutral air, like this. As you see, you can't dodge it, there are no dodge windows for the enemy on this one. So this is a combo you really want to try to remember, because every time you hit them with the down signature, you know you can do a neutral air, do some extra nice damage, hit your opponent some more. 
which is always great to know. So this combo is really important to remember. Then for the last combo with the spear, this one is kind of hard. It's gonna be a down signature, then you dodge downwards so you land, you do a down light into a gravity cancel neutral signature. Putting it all together, it's gonna to look something like this. As you see, really interesting combo. You do a lot of damage with this and the touch windows are not too high. So it's really cool to hit this one and see how your enemy reacts to it. You can do some really, really nice damage on your friends or your enemies and impress them with your skills with this one. So it's a really sick combo to try to use, see if it works for you. You can get really low dodge windows on it. So that always makes it really nice. Moving on to the great sword, this first combo is going to be really great because it's a true combo, which means it's undodgeable. It's going to be a down signature into a neutral air. So down signature, neutral air. And it's going to look something like this. As you see, no dodge windows. So this makes it a really nice combo to always hit your enemy with. If you do a down signature, you can always do this as a follow up, which is really, really great. Next combo is also a true combo, but it's a little bit harder to get the timing just right. So that's why it's a little bit harder to do, but it does a little bit more damage as well. It's going to be a down signature into a recovery, which is going to look something like this. As you see, zero dodge windows on this one as well, but still it's harder to time. As you see there, it's three dodge windows and on this one four. So you get to get the timing right perfectly because you don't have to jump too early. You have to jump, make sure you jump, jump too late. So it's hard to time it perfectly right. But if you just train this one a lot, you will get it right. And you will get zero dodge windows every time in no time. On to today's last combo. It's kind of a variation on the last one again, but it's a nice one. Indeed, it's going to be a down signature into a side air, which looks something like this. As you see, pretty nice combo. This one does have a little bit of dodge windows, but you can get them to like two or one. You can get really low dodge windows, almost impossible to dodge. And it's really nice and easy to do this one. Get your enemy on some nice damage and hit them far away if they are low on health. You can do this at any health whatsoever, which is always nice. Like let's say they're on, well, a lot of damage. You do this one, easily kill them with it, which is always nice to be able to do. So great combo, you should try it out sometime. See if it works for you. That was it again for this video. For my overall thoughts on Arcadia, I think she's a pretty cool legend. I haven't been able to use her that much as she's fairly new. So I haven't used her that much in like real, real battles, but I think she's cool. I always like the spear. So that's always nice. And there are some really cool combos with her. So try to use her, see if you like her. And well, maybe you can use her as your main. You never know. So that was it for this video. If you liked it, if you learned something from it, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.